Meme, you know what? What's I'm... going on, guys? Hi, guys. What's up? Top eight, overclocked four. I, 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 I'm I, gonna be real with you. I have not been watching doubles whatsoever. Have you? Have you, have you, uh, have you seen this? I, I tuned into that last set mostly because three people in my carpool were in it. So. Oh, word. My carpool's coming through, making me that money. But yeah, Teams is really, really big here in New England. They're one of the few regions that still take Teams very seriously. Oh, I love that. Um, that's the reason I don't like doubles. It's because people don't take us seriously. So that, that's good to hear. Yeah, and this is a cloud band event. So we've definitely been able to see a different uh, combination of Teams. And right now, we got a uh, winner semifinal between Kool-Aid and Entarps against uh, Rafi and DM. Yeah, it's interesting that you brought up the uh, banned cloud thing, because that's been like a shtick that's been going on like all month. Adam banned at Canada Cup, Midwest Mayhem, and we've been seeing some very interesting picks. I know Canada Cup had a bunch of Marios in that top eight bracket. Yeah, it's weird the, the kind of dynamics you get when you don't have cloud mm. on teams. Usually I expect to see a lot more Bayonetta, because Bayonetta is just as good in, as, in teams as cloud is. Right. But we're seeing a different combination of uh, characters here. I know Entarps was playing Diddy Kong earlier. He's opting to play Corn here with Kool-Aid Zero Suit Samus, and I know Rafi and uh, DM are pretty static. They usually always go uh, Rob and Pikachu. And First Blood, drawn by the blue team here, does that tipper pin taking a the sock there from Rafi. And you know, Corn can definitely be pretty useful in the doubles meta, you know, because he, he can easily just catch someone completely off guard with the pin. Just like the side B, because you can't pay attention to all four characters at the same time sometimes. So. Yeah, she's got some crazy hitboxes around her, which I think what makes her a really strong teams character. But what makes her not a good one is obviously when Cloud's in the in the picture, because Cloud just gets wrecked. Oh, and that just, was that was really good. That was unfortunate though, because like DM was like, I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna try to save you with this thunder, and then uh, ended up killing. Honestly, man, honest, with, the, the, when the you made Rob, you was gonna kill. It. When you made Rob, you deserve it. What? What? Why? He's a what happened to you? Useless prefer peripheral. It's like Blue Team has Blue Team has not lost a single stock. This is looking bleak. Yeah, great DI on the boost kick there from DM, and uh, there we go. Just as you said, Aussie. Red Team getting on the board here with a uh, stock courtesy of Rafi's forward smash. Yeah, I mean you saw that roll coming in. Just needs one good read. Now see if they can try to carry this momentum. Corn's still sitting at 136 percent. Yeah, and this is kind of the awkward part, especially for a character like Pikachu that has really, uh, you know. Uh, close proximity range. It's going to be really hard for DM to kind of generate any sort of offense or to kill Corn. But just as I say that, able to quick attack its way underneath the, the elongated hitboxes and get the forward, uh, the up smash. But now both players on red team at super high percents. If they both lose their stock, it's pretty much just going to be over at that point. Yeah, Rafi is obviously going to want to try to hold on to this as long as he humanly can. But uh, you know, Ooh. judging just by the dynamics of how things are looking right now, I don't know if that's necessarily going to be the case. Rafi's been doing a good job with his aiming here. A lot of projectiles being very tacked on. Good quick attack. Oh, oh no! no. Rafi got a oh, miscommunication. They both lost their stocks immediately. This is looking like a rap for Rafi. <laughs> for Rafi the rapper. Ra okay, man. listen. He didn't. He didn't do anything wrong. Oh, geez, he, he was just—he he was in the wrong spot, at the wrong time. Got neutral aired by DM. Yeah, just, and now Kool-Aid and Entarts can just kind of take their time with this. I mean, you see him going for something crazy. That's kind of what you can do when you're up, obviously, you know, four stocks to one in teams. Rob's kind of Rob's kind of like a big target too, you know, like. Yeah, just look at him. Yeah, it's like so awkward the way that like. He seems bigger like, from Brawl, but I know that's not true. Yeah, it's just like. When you think of how like the size cannon translates over to Smash, it's, yeah. just, it's definitely not a one to one because well, Olimar in real is, in real life, Olimar is like a tiny little Yeah, he's the size of a quarter or something. Uh, Kirby is like eight inches or something yeah. tall. And then you got Rob, which is a toy. Yeah. Like a little bit bigger than your Sonic amiibo over there. Like, That's just, right, just I a got little this bit bigger. Lovely Sonic amiibo. It's not Sonic. It's Metal Sonic. Metal Sonic. Shadow Su Akami. Dude, what if you he, are what if Metal's actually the new Echo Fighter? And not shadows. It's Yo, I'd actually, I'd, I'd be on board with that. Actually, that'd be kind of cool. I take those. Are they adding more Echo Fighters? I feel like they're no, not. No, actually, they said specifically that they're not adding. Echo Thank Fighters, God. So give us unique characters. Piranha Plant. Let's go. I still am not waking up. I have. I woken love up Piranha yet. Plant, dude. I saw that trailer. I was losing my mind. Just like these contenders are about to lose their minds. Game oh, number two in okay. Smashville. Back to basics. We got double. Diddy Kong. Yeah, so I know, that, I know that Rafi had a Diddy Kong, obviously, because a lot of the matchups that Rob struggles in are the matchups that Diddy Kong does really well in. So, obviously, Zero Suit Samus and Corn's uh, one that comes to mind. Um, I didn't know Tim, DM had a Diddy Kong, so I don't know if it's just them kind of just, you know, 
horsing around, or maybe this is like a, a calculated strategy of some sort. But. I mean, like you said, uh, Diddy's are really good against characters like Zero Suit Samus, who uh, thrive off of trying to be in the oh, air, but oh like Kool Aid. Oh, okay. Doesn't yeah. even care. Takes up to the top. We got Rocket Bell Boost coming out. Again, oh, good up tilt right there to interrupt the forward smash there from, uh, I believe that was uh, Raffi. And again, Kool Aid just go right back to work here. Showing that Zero Suit Samus is kind of an awkward character in teams. Her kit just doesn't necessarily translate over as well as other characters can. And I know Kool Aid primarily plays a lot of Sheik in teams, but maybe just trying to go for a different flavor, play a different role. Up Smash still not going to get the kill just yet. Great DI on the part of Kool Aid. He's definitely looking, trying to look for that opening. Kool Aid again coming up with the up air. Just lands the second one, takes away DM's first stock. Blue team with yet another lead. Coming in pretty strong here. They're both at high percents, though. They're both down, one down tilt away to up smash. There's the first one. Can they land another one? They're both looking for the down tilt against Kool Aid. And what I like what they're doing right now, I'll see, is that they're controlling space a lot better than they were before. Like, just look at how far apart N Tarps and Kool Aid are, and just look how far Call down. Call him out! Yeah, just look how far down Raffi fell into Blast Zone. So. Came back with a backer. I feel it. Okay, oh, uh, everyone's oh just expl God. Everyone's exploding. <laughs> I don't know what can you say. That, that was a good call out from DM. Knew he, that he was immediately not going to go for that air dodge. Connected the spike, sent him flying. Good stuff. My chair just sank down. That's why I didn't say anything. I was spooked, man. I, I didn't, I didn't want to address it. Here we go. Three stocks to three stocks. We have a kick coming out from the insta pin. Oh, and the kick once again. Still going to get the job done. So now both Rafi and DM uh, on their last stocks here. The platform duel coming out. Yeah, literally everyone was on that platform. That, that is not big enough to hold four characters. <laughs> it's like the rent on that platform yeah. is probably more than the most small apartments in New York City. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm sure that Smash Bros. platform is worth like, oh, my Lord, Kool-Aid. Went super deep, sacrificing his stock, but it's totally a trade. Well worth it, because now you got your last Diddy Kong high percent, like, He's going to need a miracle, and this is not where you want to be. Wow, that was actually a really good angle there from DM. And how did he get back? How was he... How did he not get hit by any of that? I don't think Kool-Aid was expecting him to take that angle that he did. I figured he was expecting him to, like, charge more or, like, take a more direct angle to the stage. Paralyzer to the boost kick. Not going to work just yet, but the Dragon Fang shot. Just claw him. Take a, take, take a little snag out of him. There he goes. We see the replay here. Well, I mean, what's, what's there to watch here? Paralyze. Right? Like, he puts him on the platform. It's more paralyzing. Dragon Fang shot. I mean, you got, you got the double paralyze coming out from both those characters. You know, like, what, 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 what more could you ask for besides getting stunned over and over? Did you want to show your amiibo on screen? I know, oh, yeah. I know you picked it up earlier. You were very proud of it. He actually made this himself, folks. He went, so, into, he went into the garage, got his, uh, got his two by four out. Yeah, shout out to Akami, out. man. She is a. a oh, she. Okay, I, I was. I thought you made it. <laughs> I thought you were. I thought you, I thought you were. Nowhere near talented enough. How to do, do people that. even make those amiibos? I'm actually very curious. How I don't know, man. Come to be. 